Living that console streamer life ain't easy, my friends. You feel a little left out because you don't get the bells and whistles and on-screen notifications to make you feel like people are going to enjoy your stream. But guess what? There's an awesome program out there that I'm gonna show you that's easy and effective to use to get on-screen alerts so that way you can celebrate in the hype for all those follows and subscribers that you're getting to your channel. If you're a console streamer, you're not gonna wanna miss this, so let's go. It's me, it's Wild coming at you super strong to make sure that your live streaming career on Twitch is gonna be bigger and better. If this is your first time here and you need help with tips and tricks and how to's, this is the perfect channel for you. So make sure you hit that big red subscribe button down below and tick that bell. So in my videos, go live for you. I can't actually believe I nailed that in one take, awesome. To get awesome stream alerts from your console to your broadcast, you first need to log into your Twitch account and go to the top right corner where you can click on your profile. Then click on Creative Dashboard and go over to the left ledger where it has extensions. When you click on extensions, you will have the option to search for a particular extension under Discovered. This is where I want you to type in O, W, N, the number three and D. Here you will see free stream alerts. Go ahead and install this. When installing the extension, we need to configure it. When configuring, we first need to pick what will be a theme that will be displayed on your stream. Now at the moment, owned offers free versions and paid versions. More on this later. Let's just go with the free version of the Pixel series. Click on this and install the theme pack. When you've selected your theme pack, we just have to configure the alerts. Go over to the left side and click on configure. At the moment, Owned allows you to make alerts for follow, sub, resub, cheer, host, and raid. For this tutorial, I'm just gonna concentrate on the follow side, but it's the same steps. so when you have free time, just make adjustments as you see fit. Scroll down to follow, and here's where you get to pick a title and a subtitle. These will be what displays on the text version for when you get a triggered alert. So it'll say blank name is now following. You can make whatever changes you want. I'm just gonna leave it the way it is and keep it nice and basic. When you've gone through all the alerts that you've configured, we wanna test to make sure that they work and that they look fine. Open up the preview section at the top right corner and this will open up a browser window. Click on any of the alerts you wanna test, like follow right here, and give it a few seconds and it'll populate up an alert. And this is exactly what your viewing audience is going to see when they hit certain triggers like follow and sub. It's super cool that console streamers now can have alerts without the need of like OBS or a capture card. This program comes in super clutch. Now, if you think you're going to use it, you may wanna consider getting a premium license, okay? The premium license unlocks more theme packages to, you know, dedicate to your stream to give it that personalized flair for you, as well as unlock more customization options per each alert and gives you variation options. Super cool, you may wanna consider it. If you are interested in that, hey, I'm gonna put a link down below that takes you right to it. Full disclosure, it's an affiliate link for me because I'm sponsored by Owned. I just wanna save you a little bit of extra cash, but thank you for supporting my channel if you do go through it. Now you're not done yet. You actually have to activate the installed extension into your Twitch channel. To do that, all you need to do is go to My Extensions and under the free stream alerts from Owned, click on Activate and go down to Set as Overlay. Now the extension is live within your Twitch channel. A lot of people forget this step, so please make sure you do it. So now when you broadcast from something like your Xbox or PlayStation and you get a new follower or you get a new subscriber, you're gonna get those awesome triggered alerts. Now Owned is not without its flaws. This is still in beta, so you may encounter some errors. Plus, it's not a perfect program. One of the biggest pushbacks you're gonna notice about it is not everybody will see the extension alerts, and that's because it's actually a limitation of Twitch. Now, people can only see the extensions when they view it from something that can read extensions, which is only at the moment PC. So people who are viewing your stream on a PC will see it, but people on mobile devices won't, and that's because of the limitation of Twitch. Twitch says they're gonna make their extensions 
mobile accessible, but they've been saying that for a year and a half now. So we'll see when that actually happens. But this is still better than nothing. So if you've stuck around this long, I'm gonna give you an awesome tip on how to maximize using Owns Alerts. Now, if you've noticed, there is one big triggered alert that's missing from what it offers. There is no donation alert. So how do we keep on top of that and give the hype and appreciation for when people give us money? Well, you wanna use it in combination with another program out there. You wanna use CloudBot from Streamlabs. Go to Streamlabs, create an account, and make sure you enable CloudBot into your channel for when you stream. And you wanna to go to modules. Under modules, you're gonna see something here that says chat alerts. So every time you get a follower or a subscriber or you get a raid, it'll actually put a chat message within your channel that you can read out and celebrate the hype. And if you set up your donations through Streamlabs, yes, it will also announce when you get a donation and for what amount and who it's from. So that way you won't get an on-screen alert, but at least it'll be over in the chat box of your channel. So that way you can acknowledge it. And that's how you get a one-two punch to dominate with these alerts with Streamlabs. God, I'm so good at giving you the best information on tips and tricks. This is an amazing one. You guys really wanna do this if you're a console streamer. Now, this is just the tip of the iceberg of what I know to make you an awesome streamer if you stream exclusively from a console. If you want more tips and tricks and videos from me on console streaming or anything in general, hey, leave me a comment down below and let me know what you struggle with and I'll be more than happy to see what I can do to help you out. Hey, while you're down there, don't forget to hit subscribe and like. It really does help me out. So I appreciate it oh so much. Now I'm gonna do you a favor. I'm gonna put a video over here to the side that shows you some awesome additions to console tricks, tips, and all that fun stuff, and another word I can't think of, that you're gonna wanna check out at the end of this video, plus another one from YouTube that's gonna be recommended to you. Until next time, all you awesome people, keep dominating it on console streaming, and I will see you all later. Take care, and of course, peace!